is a four row repeat worked on a multiple of four. For my sample, I have 16 stitches. I'm using worsted weight yarn and US size eight needles. For row one, you're going to start by knitting the first two stitches and then the repeat for row one is knit two together. Yarn over twice. Slip slip knit. So again you knit two together. Yarn over twice and slip slip knit. And you will finish the row by knitting the last two stitches. For row two, again you start by knitting the first two and for row two the repeat is purl one and now we've come to our double yarn over from the previous row. So you're just going to purl into the front of the first yarn over. And then in the second yarn over, you're just going to purl into the back loop. Whoops, I gotta get my yarn in the right position here. Purl into the back loop. And then you purl one. So it's purl, purl into the front of the first yarn over, and then purl into the back of the second yarn over, and purl. And you will finish the row by knitting the last two stitches. And for row three, again you start by knitting the first two stitches. And then the repeat for row three is yarn over, slip slip knit, Knit two together and yarn over. So we're beginning and ending our repeat in row three with a yarn over, which is going to create a double yarn over for row four. So when you finish your repeat, you might want to put your finger over your yarn over that is ending the repeat so it doesn't fall off when you're making the yarn over to begin the next repeat. So the repeat again for row three, yarn over, slip slip knit, knit two together, and yarn over. and end the row by knitting the last two stitches. And for row four, you knit the first two, and then you purl one, and then the repeat is purl two, You're going to purl into the front of that double yarn over and then purl into the back loop of the second yarn over. So 
So that's your repeat for row four. Purl two, into your double yarn over, you're purling into the front, and then you purl into the back of the second yarn over. And then you're going to end the repeat with purl three, and then knit the last two stitches. And you just repeat those four rows for the pattern 